Back with a developing story in Portsmouth, the city wants to take advantage of its waterfront property. Let me give you an example. They want to move City Hall and other public buildings right here. The plan is to put a new venue along the river to bring more money to the city. 13 News Now reporter Adriana de Alba spoke to the mayor about what's next. That's right, David, in the city and the developers still have a lot of details to iron out before we can see this come to fruition. Things like cost and a timeline still need to be negotiated, but the mayor says this is something he wants for the city of Portsmouth. This is the apartment complex that could make its way onto the Portsmouth waterfront. It would move City Hall away from the water. Development company Armada Hoffler has proposed a high-end apartment complex with about 200 units, complete with retail space and parking. It also proposed building a new City Hall downtown on County Street, where a municipal parking currently stands. Yeah. Okay, and can I get you something to drink? Uh, We've got sodas and things in here. We Angela Clark owns the coffee shop just blocks away from where the proposed complex would sit. I'm all about it. Anything that draws people down here. Yep, I have new merchandise coming in for spring. Just next door at the Little Shops on High, owner Nettie Fisher hopes the city decides to approve the complex. It makes perfect sense. It's a win-win. We need people on the street. Look at the street. Tonight, there's a public hearing, and City Council will vote toward opening up negotiations between the city and the developer, the same developer of Town Center in Virginia Beach. Portsmouth Mayor John Rowe wants to move forward with these plans. It's going to be a total makeover of this area. Downtown's where people want to live now. Once the city works out a negotiation with the developer, it'll vote once again to finalize this project. We're live in Portsmouth, Adriana de Alba, 13 News Now.